Hey guys, welcome. This is Turbo Terry here. So today we're going to have a little bit different of a video. I'm just going to talk about kind of Brainerd and stuff that's going to be happening next week. I'm going to be heading down there. I think we're just Gavin and, and Dylan, and my cousins there. Um, so I'm going to clean up my SRT4. I started a little bit. She's looking a little dirty. Um, so I got to do that. And then I'll kind of give a little bit more of what's going on for Brainerd. So, uh, yeah, I better get started on this. And I got baseball practice. I got to go coach baseball in a little bit. So might be a little bit rushed, a little bit more than I would like. But uh, let's see what we can get done. Some of the only bad things about cleaning up your car is you get to see all the, the things that are wrong with it, which isn't bad. Um, I just, I don't know, like you see a little, a lot, like a lot of the little nicks and knacks that are on your paint job and stuff like that. And it just thinks like, I don't know. It just makes you think like, golly, I just wish that wasn't there, but she looks, she looks infinitely better. I think still a little bit dirty on some spots because it's been sitting there for a little bit. I got to, I got to go over with a microfiber towel and stuff like that. And the bad thing about it is I'm out here at mom's. I don't really have the best area to, uh, to do this on because what, I either do it on the grass and it gets a little dirty still after you wash it from the grass or you do it on the gravel, a little bit of gravel we got here and it gets muddy right away. So <clears throat> I got to take it into town and I got to go to the four seasons and do it there and stuff like that but uh i don't know i like cleaning it I feel like it looks nice now got a few things i gotta pick up for it for brainerd probably gonna get a windshield cover on it um so my you know dash and stuff like that stays healthy gotta clean up the interior a little bit just it's a little bit dusty um honestly just from sitting and then i got to look at some seat covers i don't want seat covers because I love my seats, but I don't want that leather to uh, to kind of fade out. So I, I kind of want to keep keep that looking nice. So I might end up getting some leather here. I picked up some things for my car, actually for Brainerd. I know they may be a little dumb, but uh, picked up some decals. That'll probably end up going like right there in the corner of my window right there. Um, picked up some stem covers. They're supposed to be like big glow in the dark kind of cool things. I'm never gonna, like, I'm not gonna wear these all the time. Pretty much just for Brainerd. If they work, they work. If not, I'm not gonna use them. Um, the decal thing is just says Turbo Terry, my YouTube. Um, if anyone down there wants to go you know, check it out, stuff like that. <clears throat> if anyone is actually from Minnesota or going to Brainerd that's watching this and you see this car, by all means, come up and talk to me about it. Um, like, I, like I've said before, I'm not like super, super car knowledgeable but uh it's really answer some some questions if people don't know too much about srt4s you know I, it's not like i'm completely dumb but i mean i know i know quite a bit about them so um <clears throat> uh once i get going on the road here i'll talk a little bit more about brainerd and what's to come so uh i'll catch y'all when i'm on the road hey guys so now i'm on the road here told you guys i would talk to you a little bit more about what the heck's going on down here for brainerd um, so June 9th, 10th, and 11th, um, my cousins, Dylan, Gavin, and I, we're all going to go up there um, at the Brainerd Raceway there. So it, it used to be called like Proving Grounds or something like that, Dylan was saying. Um, so that was kind of like drifting, stuff like that. They got like drag racings, um, just kind of like a car show, like everyone parks their cars. Um, you ride around like little bikes or you can walk, I guess, if you want. Just kind of taking a look at everyone's vehicle, stuff like that. So uh, I opted to take this vehicle down there. Um, we're going to take a Ford pickup down there, and then we're going to uh, haul our bikes in there. We got three mini little, like, kind of little pit bike things, cross rocket things. I don't even know what they are. Um, ride those around there. So what I plan on doing is taking this, making it look super nice, Kind of just getting like i said my decal stuff like that on there and then kind of just having it for a show show vehicle there um i don't plan on like 
like dragging it or like like racing it anyway, like autocrossing, none of that. Like I don't plan on doing that. It's a new vehicle. I don't need to do that to it. Dylan's trying to talk me into it. He thinks it's such a huge, jolly idea for me to uh, go and race this and stuff like that. But what does it do besides ruin my vehicle? And I don't need that. Like I like this vehicle. Why would I want to go drag, race it, and tear it apart? So that's pretty much what's happening here with this Brainerd thing. I'm probably going to take off on the 9th, I think it's Friday. So probably going to end up taking off at like 1 in the morning that day. So we can get down there in time. Um, so I think we're taking off work Friday and then we got the weekend off obviously. So I'll probably end up uh, taking off at 1 in the morning, getting down there. Hopefully, I got to pass this person real quick. Hopefully get some um, pictures. I'm going to try to record. Um, I don't know how much this phone can handle. I might end up buying a little camera. Um, I know I really don't really want to do that. <clears throat> I just registered this car and stuff like that. Like I know I've owned it for a while. I haven't really made it into town in the DMV. So like I get that uh, that's probably not the best thing right now for me to go and buy a camera. But if I can record off the camera, I can get pictures and stuff like that for my YouTube and stuff, I think it might be worth it. So I guess I'll see what uh, <clears throat> the damage will be for that. But I don't know. It's It'll be fun. Super fun to go down there, meet other people. Gavin and Dylan went last year. They said it's, it was a blast. You know, people are always nice to you about your vehicles. Um, hopefully, honestly, I can see another SRT4 there. Um, or maybe a couple. If I do, obviously, I'm going to record that. Hopefully, try to remember that, take pictures. Um, I'm new to all this vlogging and stuff like that, so I, it's just different. All right? Um, I'm not, I don't really like pulling out my camera in front of people because I get embarrassed. I mean, I was out at my parents today, obviously, cleaning up my car, and I didn't want to pull out my camera in front of mom. Like, I just, people just make funny for stuff like that. I know I'm super small. Like, I'm a super small channel. I got 24 of you guys, but I, I just don't want to get bullied, I guess, which is sad, but that's the honest to God truth. So, I mean, if I don't get a lot of footage, I'm sorry. I'm going to try. I just got to kind of work through the barrier of me talking to my phone while people are walking around and stuff because I'll kind of think I'm goofy, but... I don't know. I guess I'll see how much footage I, footage I can get for everyone, but uh, I figured I would just kind of give a brief, short, quick rundown of what the heck's happening here. But yeah, so I'll probably try to record a little bit of the footage on the way down there, and when we get there, obviously I need some footage on the way back. Um, but that's honestly all I had for you guys today, you know, it's just kind of a brief update of what the heck's going on. I haven't really posted in about a week or two. Um, this brand new thing is pretty big. I was trying to kind of getting my work schedule and everything like that figured out so um that's why i really haven't been doing too much on this but um when we get back from brandon i kind of got some other vehicles i've been thinking about talking to people see if i can use them and make videos on them and stuff like that so hopefully when we get back from brandon um i'll get that brandon video up that might take me a little bit to edit and stuff like that so please be patient if i get this one up you know uh within today or tomorrow so give me a little bit that might take me a little bit of time um I know it's about a week out, so I'm going to have to edit this video, and then that'll be what you guys get for a week, I guess, which kind of sucks, but, uh, and then I'll have to try to get that branded stuff up, but yeah, like I said, I got some other stuff coming here in the near future, hopefully, and uh, I'm pretty excited, and I hope you guys are as excited as I am, but uh, I'll catch y'all in the next one. This has been Turbo Terry.